I have some crazy footage to show you. This is coming from an independent journalist who snuck into the back of the Roosevelt Hotel in Manhattan into an intake room for illegal immigrants. Notice the makeup of these people, how many men, women, and children are, and just watch this entire thing unfold. Check it out. You don't mind me asking, how did you get here? How, how do how do you get to New York? Them. Yeah. Them. Uh, no. Airplane to New York? Mm. Did you travel over border? Over wall? Oh, border? Uh, Mexico? Oh. Okay. You came over Mexico? Mm. Okay. Did you? No. no. Hi. Hi. Hello? Excuse me, sir. Where are you from? Where are you from? Huh? Which one is that from? I'm just that. Excuse me, sir. Where are you from, Senegal? That's easily over 90% men in their 20s, 30s, and 40s. I didn't really see any children. A couple of women were there. But notice how the security is trying to kick this guy out. He's getting treated worse than the people who are legally crossing over into what's supposed to be a sovereign country. Allowed to come in here, allowed to fly, staying in this Roosevelt Hotel, given hotel rooms, given education, health care, food, jobs, food stamps. Yet this guy is in there. He's a U.S. citizen trying to go around, figure out what's going on. And the, as soon as they find out that this man is in there just trying to do some investigative work, immediately security comes in to get him the heck out of there. This is what we should really be doing at the border, you know, identifying people who are not supposed to be in the country and then removing them from that situation. But we do it to our own citizens instead. Can somebody tell me why we have 20, 30, 40 year old men upwards of 90 percent in this room? Why does this smell of a conspiracy hiding these individuals away, processing them in these locations and then sending them out and spreading them into the rest of the United States? Doesn't this seem like we're being attacked from the inside? Doesn't it seem like our current administration or whoever's in charge is purposefully trying to destroy the United States of America by flooding in individuals who really have no business being here, probably have no interest in assimilating into the culture that is here. Our current administration, liberalism, Democrats, Joe Biden, Obama, whatever you want to say, this is the correct way to do things. This is great for the United States of America. This is great for our sovereignty and rule of law. This is going to completely benefit the United States of America instead of focusing on shutting down the border and then allowing legal immigration into the United States the right way perfectly vetting those individuals that are coming in and ensuring that this is a process that is going to be mutually beneficial for the United States of America and the individual coming in, not the mess that is being created by our current administrations, not these leftist and liberal ideologies that have taken hold. What do you think about this? Leave your comments below. I'll catch you in the next video.